Pisces may try to pretend relationship problems don't exist. Pisces can be dreamers, and while hoping for the best isn't a bad thing on its own, it can be if it takes Pisces out of reality. A Pisces's desire for everything in a relationship to be perfect can lead them to ignore the actual problems right in front of them. Problems will continue to go unresolved, and their partner will become more and more unhappy as this water sign continues to ignore the issues. Eventually, a Pisces will have to face reality and have open communication with their partner. Or they will face the reality of no longer having a relationship. Aquariuses may be in a relationship as a way to rebel. Aquarians are known for being fiercely independent and even as a bit of a loner. Being in a relationship might not be necessary for an Aquarius as they do enjoy their freedom. This doesn't mean they have no interest in being in loving a relationship, but sometimes they may be in it for the wrong reasons. Their rebellious streak may lead them to continue a relationship not necessarily out of love, but because others disapprove. For instance, if the parents of an Aquarius insists their offspring only date someone with a certain amount of money, look for the Aquarius to go out with someone in a low tax bracket, even if the two aren't otherwise compatible. More Aquarius January 20 February 18 The funniest memes that describe what it's like to be an Aquarius in 2020 11 of 12 What medieval armament you should wield? Capricorns need someone who doesn't mind a lack of romance. Capricorns are great at sticking through during tough times in a relationship because they are logical enough to know when it's merely temporary. However, that logical side also means they have less of an emotional side and are less likely to get caught up in the idea of romance. If they are with a partner who is hoping to get swept off their feet, this will be a problem. But, if the partner is okay with things being steady and reliable, they are in luck. You probably won't get a surprise romantic getaway with a Capricorn. You will get someone loyal and devoted without drama. Sagittarius, I need to keep the excitement alive. Sagittarius crave constant excitement and new experiences. For that reason, they love the rush they feel at the beginning of a relationship. However, once the honeymoon phase passes, they can lose interest, which means they need a partner who can keep them on their toes. If a relationship can constantly throw new challenges at them, they'll want to stick around. But if things go stale, they'll seek excitement elsewhere. Scorpios maybe scare away partners with too much snooping. Scorpios don't like to fully commit till they know they've got a sure thing. But how do you know you've got a sure thing or not? This can mean this water sign invites their partner to open up. Or it can mean snooping around the internet to get as much of their partner's backstory as possible. In any case, this intensity can be uncomfortable for a partner. It can also be frustrating, as Scorpios tend to keep a lot of secrets themselves. If a Scorpio indulges in sleuthing and prying too much, the relationship might end before it even gets a chance to get started. Libras may have unreasonable romantic expectations. Libras love being in love, or at least the idea of being in love. When it comes to relationships, Libras expect the kind of romance you see in fairy tales or rom-coms. In other words, they are often in a world of fantasy rather in a world of reality. For a relationship with a Libra to work, they have to lower their expectations. If they expect things to be perfect all the time, 
the relationship will fall short. But if they accept that a relationship will have its share of ups and downs, they may be able to ride things out. Virgos might get burned when falling for a fixer-upper. Virgos enjoy being needed since they are the sign of the helper. While this can make Virgos pleasant to be around, it also means some people may take advantage of their helpfulness. It also means they may fall for people with a lot of problems that need fixing, since that allows the Virgo to feel useful. However, if their partner has very serious problems, it may be too much for a Virgo to handle and they'll feel drained. A Virgo has to find that line between giving as much as possible without feeling like someone is taking advantage of them. Leos don't want competition for the spotlight. Leos love to be the center of attention, but it's not actually because they are arrogant. Instead, Leos tend to be insecure, and they crave attention and compliments in order to put themselves at ease. A result, this fire sign needs to be someone willing to give them that reassurance, and who doesn't mind if they get most of the glory. It's not a role everyone is willing to play. A Leo needs to find that special selfless someone in order to make it work. More Leo, July 23, August 22, 5 of 12, what medieval armament you should wield, based on your zodiac, 5 of 12, things you suck at, according to your zodiac sign, 5 of 12, which Spider-Man villain are you, according to your zodiac? Cancers need a mate who fits in with their squad. Cancers have a tight-knit crew of people with whom they are close. Instead of going out to big gatherings, they'd rather spend time with their small circle of friends or close family members. Building trust with a Cancer may take some time, because only a select few get that level of approval, and part of that acceptance process is being liked by their close confidants. To paraphrase the Spice Girls, if you want to be a Cancer's lover, you gotta get with their friends. Poor communication drives Gemini's bonkers. Gemini's tend to be extroverts and love chatting with every person in their lives. Communication skills come naturally to Gemini's, and they expect the same from others. This doesn't just mean talking for the sake of talking, it means honest communication between partners about their feelings. If a Gemini is with someone who tends to withdraw rather than be open about their emotions, that communication breakdown will likely lead a relationship breakdown. Or Gemini May 21 June 20 The best movies for Gemini's 3 of 12 What medieval armament you should wield based on your zodiac 3 of 12 things you suck at according to your zodiac sign. Tauruses hate being rushed. Tauruses hate being rushed. Aries don't want someone who holds them back from their dreams. Aries don't want someone who holds them back from their dreams. Hey guys, thank you so much for the support and likes and comments down below and also thank you so much for watching and I look forward to see you in the next video then. Take care. Bye.